watching this is mike cernovich i get a lot of death threats and people in the fake news media claim that i don't well i have actually a live audio recording that was taken outside of an event that was held by me and in the audio you hear two things one is people chanting and then two you hear a member of the domestic terrorist group antifa say tell cernovich and gavin to come out bring their children. So again, the fake news media claims that I don't actually receive threats. You can watch this video in real time and listen to it yourself. And let's decide who's telling the truth and who isn't. What do you want to do to their kids? What do you want to do to their kids? Why did you say that? What the fuck are you talking about? He just said he wants Cernovich's kids out here. Uh, you heard it right. So right there, you just heard uh, audio threats directed at um, me and my child. The media claims I do not get these. This video was live streamed. You can authenticate it quite simply and quite easily. This is not selectively edited. I'll post the original video. So one more time, let's just go ahead and listen. Um, again, you're going to hear chanting, oh, but listen to the person, the male voice in the background that says, tell Cernovich and Gavin to come out, bring their children. What do you want to do to their kids? What do you want to do to their kids? Why did you say that? What the fuck are you talking about? He just said he wants Cernovich's kids out here. What did he mean by that? What did he, I just don't know what he meant by that. Kill yourself! Kill yourself! So, clear as a bell, right? You heard it. So th there you go. Again, that's how much the fake news lies about me, how they just lie about everybody. It's, they go, oh, you don't get threats, but we got, here's the audio, right? Here's the full unedited video, and then here's the audio where you can hear them saying, um, tell him to come out and bring his kids. It's, so it's right there. So that's how dishonest and fake the news is. However fake you think the news is, it's faker. Oh, uh, YouTube. Um, I'm checking out some comments now. Yeah, if you're on YouTube, hit the like button. Um, I'm blocking all the anti-Semitic people paid by the SPLC to, to try to make me look bad because I disavow this. So people go, oh, you're this. I disavow any insult based on religion, whether you're Muslim, Islam, Christian, whether you're white, whether you're black, Latina, whatever your, your immutable characteristics are, and even religion. If you're a Christian, I don't support uh, putting a Bible in a toilet. I wouldn't put a Quran in a toilet. I wouldn't put a Bible in a toilet. I wouldn't put a Torah in a toilet. I wouldn't put anything. I don't think anybody should do that. So the fake news media lies. Here's your regular reminder. I got no tolerance for this. If you actually have hatred in your heart, bye-bye. Felicia, go somewhere else because we're not about that life. So that's why they go, oh, comments. They always vote with the comments. Well, okay, what about the comments at, at the Huffington Post and, and other places? So anyhow, anyhow, if you ever doubted just the true evil of Antifa, one last time, like and share, subscribe. If you're on Facebook, hit the emojis. One last time, let's listen to Antifa threaten the lives of children. Again, real video, real news. This isn't the fake stuff you're going to find in the fake news media. All that shit goes hand in hand. All that shit goes hand in hand. What do you want to do to their kids? What do you want to do to their kids? Why did you say that? What the fuck are you talking about? He just said he wants Cernovich's kids out here. What did he mean by that? What did he, I just don't know what he meant by that. Kill yourself! Kill yourself! So there it is. Uh, real simple, clear as a bell, real audio, real news, none of this fake news media stuff.
And it's all, it's all right there. So by the way, I love too how people go, oh, Cernovich is like unhinged. Like, dude, I'm on video every day. Well, I haven't been lately because I'm on vacation. But people are like, he's unhinged. Dude, I'm on video every day. People see me every day. So when they try to, like for their little audience, they go, oh, he's becoming unglued because of spirituality. Like, yeah, dude, I believe in energy. I believe we live in a simulation. You know, I read sci-fi. Diamond Age, fantastic book. Read it. Read Snow Crash. Read Cryptonomicon, right? That's all, like, yeah, I read sci-fi. I enjoy sci-fi. I'm into cryptocurrency. I'm into spirituality. I do Wim Hof breathing. I meditate. Uh, I pray. I, I focus my vision and, you know, other places. I got a mindset book, Gorilla Mindset. So I love it. Like, he's losing it. Why? Well, he's meditating more. <laughs> Cernovich is losing it. They've broken him. Why? Well, he's been meditating a lot lately and doing Wim Hof breathing in cold showers. Oh, and he takes supplements. What kind of loser meditates, takes cold showers, takes ice baths, and, and takes supplements? Well, and he drinks green juice. Oh, my God. He drinks kale juice. Mike Cernovich is... Making green juice with kale. Sometimes I put cauliflower, celery, little lemon. He's clearly, clearly lost it. He's lost it. How? Because if you pray or you meditate, you're. Um, why don't you t say that about the say that about Islam? Right. Why don't you say this guy's losing it? He's been going to the mosque. People would be like, oh, you're, you'd be fired from Huffington Post. By the way, they're going to clip that. I support people going to mosque. People need to have spirituality. People need family. That's why these people are losing their minds. Family, religion.